Hello. So here's a new video in this series Python for Data Science and this video is going to be an introduction on the Python list. To begin with the Python list is a collection of values and it can hold different data types. The different data types in Python are int which is used to represent an integer, float which is used to represent a real number, str which is string is used to hold text in python and boolean which is either true or false. These values can be saved as variables. The number 21 which is an integer is saved in a variable date and similarly Thursday which is a string is saved in a variable day. So each of this variable represents a single value. We have a data set of six Indian batsmen and their corresponding top scores in one day internationals. Suppose if we tried to store each of the data point in a separate variable, it is going to be very lengthy, time consuming as well as tiresome. So we have a solution to this problem. So instead of saving each data point in a separate variable, we are going to save the values in a python list and we can build a python list with square bracket in this way we can create a list of all the runs scored by the batsman and then save this list in a single variable so a list is a way to give a single name to a collection of values and these values can be of different data types they can be floats integer boolean strings and if we want to add the names of the players to these scores, we can do so in the following way. So this list now contains both the integer values as well as the string values. And that's not all. We can add a list inside another list. So instead of putting the strings in between the numbers, we can also create sublist for each player. So there will be one list for Tendulkar, one list for Sevag, one list for Ganguly and so on. And then this little lists are wrapped in square brackets and are separated by commas. Now the main list contains six sublists. And if we print the list as well as the type of this list, we get the output of the type as a list, which means that the list is another Python data type in addition to strings, boolean, integers and floats. Each Python data type has a special functionality and behavior associated with it and this is also true for the Python list. And we can do many more things and operations using the Python list and I will be covering that in the upcoming videos. I'll see you in the next videos. Till then subscribe to this channel and stay tuned for more videos.